Hello everyone, here's a question on ratios and the question is three numbers are in the ratio 5 to 7 is to 12 and the sum of the first and the third number is greater than the second by 50. The sum of three number is so what is given here they have given the ratio of a three number which is 5 is to 7 is to 12 and then they have given a relationship between the numbers that is the sum of the first and the third number is greater than the second by 50. We have to find out the numbers. So first we're going to take the numbers. Now since the numbers are given in the ratio, we're going to take a variable x and we're going to take the numbers as 5x, 7x and 12x. Now why we take a variable is, ratios are always given in the reduced form, that is the lowest form. So there could be common factor between them and that is the reason we're taking a variable here x. So let's take the numbers here. So let the numbers be 5x, the second number is 7x and the third number is 12x. Now from the question if you see what they have given the sum of first and third number. First number is 5x and third number is 12x. So let me write down the sum. Sum means addition. So 5x plus 12x. Okay, so what is it is? The sum of the first and the third number is greater than the second. So this whole sum, this whole sum is greater than the second number. So this uh, this is greater than the second number by 50, which means so 5x plus 2x will be equal to the second number, which is 7x plus 50. I hope it's clear how we got the uh, here the equation. Now why did we got uh, 5x plus 2x to the 7x? Let us read the statements once again. They have given that the sum of the first and the third number. So first number and third number, this whole sum is greater than the second number. Second number is 7x by 50. So if I add this two number, this two number is more uh, then the third number by how much 50 so if I add a 50 to the third number it will be equal to the sum of the first number and the third number that is what they have given now here we got an equation and we have to find the value of x once we got the value of x we're going to find the sum of the three numbers so 5x plus 12x is uh, 17x so 17x is equal to 7x plus 50 we're going to transpose 50, uh, not 50, 7x to the other side. I'm going to bring all the variables to the one side. So this will become 17x minus 7x. The sign will change. It is positive. When you transpose, the sign will become negative. So 17x minus 7x is equal to 50. Subtracted, we'll get 10x. So 10x is equal to 50. Now I want only the value of x. We don't want the coefficient 10 here. So it is like 10 into x, 10x. So 10 is in multiplication, right? So when you transpose this to the other side, it's gonna come in division. So from here, x will be equal to 50 divided by 10. So we're gonna cancel this in 10 table. So 10 ones are 10 fives are 50. So therefore we got the x value is equal to 5. Now what they are asking, they are asking us to find the sum of the three number. So three numbers we know it is 5x, 7x and 2x. So we are going to add it. So sum will be 5x plus 7x plus 2x. So when you add all these three numbers, we will get 24x. So we got the x value, we are going to substitute here. So therefore 24x is equal to 24, x means 24 multiplied by x. So 24 multiplied by x value is 5. So we're going to substitute 5 val x value as 5. So 24 multiplied by 5 which is equal to 120. So if I add all the three number the sum will be equal to 120. I hope it is clear. Only thing you have to remember is you have to remember the relationship here. You have to form an equation. Once you got the equation then you can solve it. Now in case you have any other question or doubt you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.